He was always someone who I looked up to. I still think to this day he's the greatest. Part of his genius, part of his magnificence, is the fact that he is so vulnerable. Without that vulnerable side, I don't think that he would have been the player that he was. Paul Gascoigne is the special one. Oh, he leaves two for dead, players in the middle. That's all I knew for Paul. I just loved NT and the atmosphere in the World Cup was incredible. It lifted him from being a great footballer to a national treasure. Paul Gascoigne is Gaza. Gaza is at the centre of Gaza mania. Gascoigne's expected to become the richest player in the world. Everything was coming thick and fast. You're in a position that most young men would say is a dream. It could turn out to be a nightmare, you know. Gary Lineker come up to this. And he went, Paul, be careful. It's when I found out how bad the press can be. It's frightening, really, because all I want to do is just live my own life. You don't shed tears on a football pitch if you don't care about playing for your country. I'm taking it more than anybody I can think of. And Robbie Robson went, you're playing against the best midfield player in the world. And I went, no, he is. Is Gascoigne going to have a crack? He is, you know. Oh! The 90 minutes on the football field was me. No one can touch us. I'd say he's the most exciting English player I've seen and certainly the best.